Good evening, everyone. With Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, I'm Mike Emery. Tonight, we bring you a matchup between two great teams. Close to dropping the puck now, Eddie. What's your thought? These two teams both need the W here tonight. I can see him playing it safe early, but the question is, which team will make the first mistake? Just underway. With Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, I'm Mike Emery. And this play is whistled down. It is offside. And here is the third voice of our crew, the man in the coldest place, ice side, Ray Ferraro. You can't be a very good team if you don't have good goaltenders. Both of these teams have excellent goaltenders. The shot ratio is going to be really important. You can't expect to score on one and outs against goalies this good. Trying to take the heat off, they've iced it. Solid, clean win. The boards are there to be used, and he does it with that pass. Dimitrakos is injured on the play, but he's staying out there. And in their own end, still with it. Snapping a pass to Coetzee. Backhander to the net. Wonderful chance to score, but no. Puck picked up here. Glides across. Oh, and what a spectacular save. Collected in the corner. What a hit. Oh, he got that. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over it. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. Nice play by the goaltender to freeze it up and get a whistle. Over five minutes play. Nothing on the scoreboard has changed. Still a pair of zeros. Good clean win on the draw. Pitching it to Coetzee. Pitching this one to Steen. Pass attempt to Coetzee. Takes a shot. That one blocked. Puck covered, whistle blown. The Russians prevail again. Wonderful save. Couldn't get through. Moscow's in their own end and in possession. The refs caught something, a delayed call here. Polisi's got a minor penalty here for interference. There's always a start to your power play night, and this is number one. Good job on that faceoff, tying the man up. This is an early gift to give them a power play. Eddie, I'm with you on that. Power play beginning. Our reputations are at stake here. That play went offside. The Russians do an excellent job limiting their opponent's shots on net. One of the main reasons is how many shots they block. Over the last few games, it's a crazy number. Shoots. Oh, deflected away. <laughs> Got to clear it here. And now it's directed to Kapusta. Gets in. What'll he do? He can start some danger here. Good poke check by Allen. Let's a shot fly. Oh, a close call there. He was trying to be a little bit too fine there. That's why he missed the net. Swept away. Pittsburgh's done it. Back at full strength. Two sticks together. It goes to the offense. Pittsburgh's carrying it up the wing. Around it again. Knocked it away with the stick. Puck is thrown to Steen. Carried through center ice. Goes back deep for it. Two sticks together, they cancel. Good, quick stick. That pass is cut. Gathered in by Markov. Moving it to Kapusta. Moscow's in control through the neutral zone. Jabbed away by Allen. Sliced through the neutral zone. Puck loose, denied by the defense. Gains the zone. Could this be icing? And it will be, based on the defense arriving first. Nice face-off work. Directing that one to Steen. 
on to Valesi. Laid on to Capusta. Solid work there by Valesi. One timer. Moscow's got possession in their own end. Valesi slashed. Ooh, that's going to be a penalty. Carried out of his own end towards center ice. Looking to Coetzee. And so now a penalty will be handed out. Moscow's got a minor for slashing. And so begins power play. Luck with the pad. Nearing the final minute. Another solid pad save. Put covered, whistle blown. Good job on the draw. Moscow's getting an attack ready in their own end. In the first period. Skill play by Allen. In the defensive zone, still in control. Trying to go to Coetzee. He's in on an onside play. Tripped up on the play, and there will be a penalty. Poke checked away by Valesi. Whistle blown, play stopped. The referee will hand out a penalty. Pittsburgh sent to the box for two minutes. It's tripped. The Russians with a face-off win. Pittsburgh's controlling play through center. Solid neutralized poke check. Steen's tripped and a penalty should be coming. Pittsburgh's been assessed a minor penalty. Two minutes and the call is tripping. First period has come to a close. Don't know about you, but I've got a lot of ink left here. Few entries, no goals on that scorecard. Fans, tonight our world famous Clemp is dropping $50 gift certificates. Keep your eyes to the sky for tonight's big prize. Second period about to begin here. Let's take a look back at the first. What impressed you most? Both goaltenders stock in that first period were excellent. It might be a while before we see our first goal. Opening faceoff for period two. Nothing, nothing. The Russians lug the puck in their own end. Looking to Hetman up the wing. Scooped up. Looks ahead to start something. Moscow's going back to get restarted with their advantage. Into the end of attack. Enormous collision. Well, he's been looking for that hit all night. Cleared out, and that forces them to drop back. Still time on this power play, but not much. Passing one off now to Witkowski. And he's tripped, and there'll be a penalty. Pittsburgh's got two on this one for tripping. It is a five on three for a brief time, but still a two-man advantage. He got his glove on that one. Drill, terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at, and he made it tough. He missed opportunity from this close in. Pass to the blue line. It's gotten behind the net. Moscow's back to play in their own end as the clock ticks down on the power play. Superb defensive play by Valesi. Sends to the point. The stick broke on the shot. Got his pad on that one. A little under four minutes played here in the second. Both teams are still looking for their first strike. Nice job, straight stand-up poke check. The Russians' penalty kill has gotten a workout, but still perfect. Snapping a pass to Allen. A great blocker, Turnison. Trying hard to get it out of the zone. That's a solid play, and he keeps the attack going with this. Pass off the woodwork to Valesi. To the net! Oh, my! Pressure now. Pittsburgh's in their own end and controlling play now. It's an onside play. 
Tough shot. Marvelous save. No time on that one. Not often you're all alone in front of the goaltender from this area of the ice. Great save. The Russians prevailing on the faceoff. And the puck now possessed by Markov. The Russians in their own end in possession as they travel. The poke check worked. Shifts to the backhand and shoots. Score! Only one perfect goalie remains now. Pittsburgh's dominated offensively, and finally they have scored 1-0. The Russians win that neutral zone faceoff. Pitching it to Allen. Number 77, and by number 22, time of the goal. That one fired down. The defense will win. The race and icing is called. Good faceoff win. Shot. What a reaction save. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. Snaps off a wrist shot. Cut his glove on it. The Russians up the wing lock the puck. Good defensive work there. Pitching this one to Witkowski. And offside is called on the play. They win the draw and will now set up an attack. Pass attempt to Steen. And he hammers one. Shot didn't have a lot on it, did it? Good work with the stick. Gives it to the point. It looked like to me he was just throwing this puck to net, hoping it hits something and goes in. And the linesmen were watching very carefully. That is an offside. A little under eight minutes on the clock in the second. The Russians lead 1-0. Now it's directed to Kapusta. Puck is thrown to Coetzee. Terrific hand-eye. Good defensive play. Loose puck, though. Moving into Witkowski. Pittsburgh setting things up along the boards. Fires! Great save! You're going to be seeing that save a lot in the future, Doc. Waffle boarded. Still has control in the defensive zone. Moved along and in. Snaps a shot. Outstanding save with a glove. Beat him on that one. One timer. Score! And this one is tied. Moscow's got this game even up now. And we're still in the second period. And that's a face-off win. Scored by number 45. Assisted by number 76. And by number through the corner. Time of the goal. 15 minutes, 24 seconds. He's got the puck on his stick, but can he clear it? Offensive possession here. Kicked away. Allen's in his own end, headed towards center. Pittsburgh's in control as they travel up the wing. Offside stops the clock. It's a face-off win. May not seem important in that territory, but they have possession. Let's go, Rister! And he missed it. Oh, he's going to shake his head when he thinks about this one. He's right in the garden spot between the hash marks, and he misses the net. The Russians are moving the puck in the defensive zone. In the second period. If they can get organized, maybe time for one more attack before the end of the period. Strong play, good reach. Two periods have been played. They've worked pretty hard at it, and they get a well-deserved rest. Third period coming up shortly. You want the assurance of knowing you have a ticket to all the big games? Then grab our season tickets. Guarantee your seat for the upcoming playoffs. Call the box office for more information, or check out our website. third period about to begin. The rear view mirror will help us with the first two, and so will Edzo. 
Pittsburgh's gotten themselves into some penalty trouble, Doc, but it hasn't hurt them to this point. Outstanding work. Shorthanded. Turned right away with the poke check by Markov. Feeds the point. Wrist shot. Good stick work, and for that reason, it's a chance for the offense. Pittsburgh's lugging it along in their own end. Pass ahead. He's nudged off by the defense. Has it back deep. Moves it to the shadow of the boards. Pittsburgh's in their own end, lugging it along. Good defensive play. Possession changes. Knocked right off the stick. Directing that one to Capusta. Good hand to eye. And the reach of the stick. Let's it go. Off a of body. Picks it up in his own end. Good quick poke check there. Puck loose, couldn't get through. Pittsburgh's waiting back in their own end. Puck fired down, decision made. Defenders first, icing. A little under six minutes gone. Two goals so far, divided in half. Missed! The goalie can breathe a sigh of relief. The shooter's right in the middle of the ice, and he misses the net. That puck's loose, deflected away by Allen. Gets in, looks over his options here. Shoots one. Oh, and it's off the mark. Oh, and the pass wouldn't go. And play stopped because of an offside. Moscow's prevailed again on the faceoff of the neutral zone. Got it right back. Around through the corner. He can start some danger here. Held there for a face-off coming up next. The Russians with a clean win on the draw. Looking to Valesi. Gets in. What'll he do? Broke it up well with the poke check. Let's it go. Not through. Carried from the defensive zone toward center. Trying to go to Steen. A big collision there. Oh, he took a hit to make a play along the boards. Passing one off now to Valesi. Moves it to the corner. Can he generate something? He knocked it in himself! It's in the net, it counts! Moscow's got the lead now by one. Third period of play, it'll be a wonderful finish. Witkowski's got another in a long list of face-off wins. Solid work defensively by Valesi. Snapping a pass to Capusta. Loose puck, good defensive denial. Gains the blue line. He throws it there. Shoots! They score! That's three unanswered goals! Moscow's gotten a huge goal. Now a little breathing room in the third period. The advantage is two, but the adrenaline will probably start to flow from the other side. Two guys together with force. Big force. The Russians control the play at center. To Kapusta. Shot. Score! And it's a one-goal game. The Russians have struck back, only trailing by a single goal, and we're in the dramatic third period. And they take that neutral zone faceoff. To Kapusta. Good standing poke check by Allen. Pitching it to Steen. Flips that wrist shot. No! What a chance! He was in the right area of the ice there. You gotta make the goaltender work. Good job with the stick. Carries it to the corner. And there's a delayed penalty call. That shot came from nowhere. You wanna score goals, you have to go to this area. You gotta find a way to put it in the net. 
Pittsburgh's only going to get two minutes on this call, but it was tripping. This has been a power play that's gotten a lot of times, but no goals. Maybe that'll change with this one. So on this power play, they will resume from their own end of the ice. Good defensive play, hand to eye and center ice. No luck! You score right there, that puts them away. Pitching this one to Capusta. A long game, and the clock leads down to the final minute of regulation. Oh, what a hit! That slowed things down. The fans along the glass gotta love that hit. Gains the zone and looks over his options. And another strong save. Down to ringside we go yet again. Ray, what you thinking? Parsons quietly gets himself into position, and when the puck is delivered, he's able to one-time it quickly. Okay, Ray, let's see how it goes for him here. They win the draw. Now can they get it out? And he gains the zone. Possession taken up by Allen. Into the attacking end. He got in! On the outside, a shot. Witkowski's tripped up. That should be a penalty. Penalty call coming. Watch for his signal here. Allen's going to the box. It's a tripping minor. It is a five on three for a brief time, but still a two-man advantage, and the face-off will start it off. Moscow's power play is over. Not too successful tonight. And that's an offside. And yet again, here is Ray Ferrar. Parsons has been a key to the offensive game plan. They get the puck to the point. He moves along the blue line and delivers it to the front of the net. That's terrific, Ray, and so is he. We'll see how it goes for him here tonight. Moscow's got it off the draw at center. Gets in, and he'll look over his options. Outstanding work with the glove. And he holds on. save and that just beat the clock too and the horn is sounded and this one goes down into the books Moscow's time of possession was enormous yet their victory was not the quality of chances weren't very high but to your point they did have the puck the majority of the evening 